Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In today's video I'm gonna show you how to create a barrel house. Not that just it is really easy to make but it's also unique and it will impress your friends. With that say, stay tuned and grab your notes and let's get started. So this is the main circle we're starting from. So basically this circle just extend 10 more blocks towards side on each block. Then after we finish that, just take a spoon trapdoor and hide the oak texture. Now after we finish the base, we need to decide which gonna, uh, part is going to be a front, which is going to be back part. Let's say this is going to be front part, so basically we we'll won't go one block inside and place four stairs like this toward the inside and then close it up in the middle. Then you're going to take a spruce plank and connect them on the side and then you have a square. In a square just place planks in the corners and with a glass pane fill it up everywhere. Now for the back part we're going to fill it up everywhere with the planks. And then we want to make a spigot, so basically place two polished underside blocks, then place stairs and then close it up with a block. On the second block we're going to put a cobblestone wall and place a spruce trapdoor on it, place two like this trapdoors and on these two trapdoors place slabs. Now we make, we're going to make uh, circles around the barrel. And we're gonna make, let's say, an illusion of support the barrel. So basically, go one block on the side, place two stairs, then you're gonna destroy three blocks, place underside block, place stairs, slap. And you're gonna do exactly the same on this side. And we're gonna make one more circle here. Now, how can we make even better support is to take oak stairs and place a normal block like this near each circle. Now, we're gonna make an entrance for our house. So basically, go one block where this circle is and place two oak planks like this and close it up Close it up with the upside down oak stairs. Just a moment. Close it up like this. Then place two stripped oak. Then place a two spruce fences on it. Then we can make a small roof using the slabs. We can create the decoration by adding the buttons. Then we need to destroy these two spruce log blocks and we're gonna add a simply a little small platform using the spruce planks and spruce stairs. And from the inside basically what we could do is place one oak fence on the right side place slab on it and we're gonna go half block up upper and upper and at the very end just close it up with a spruce drawer. Now, before we went inside, you want to go at the left side of the entrance and one block from this circle, break two blocks, and we're gonna create a window by adding just two stairs like this. 
Now we're gonna go outside the first of all what we need is a source of light. So basically place two iron bars and then place lanterns on it. A lot better, right? Now what you want to do next is take a place oak planks like this, so three, 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 and then you want to close it up with one stairs like this and one this and place two slabs. We're gonna make a small platform for our bed. On this corner here, we're gonna place two furnaces, the blast furnace and smoke. And we're gonna place two stairs, cobblestone stairs on it. And what you want to do next is cut this hole here and place a cobblestone like this. Now, by destroying that block, we see where our chimney gonna be. So basically, on that breaking block, we just place a couple stone, and then place two stairs like this, and place three cobblestone walls like this, and two on the side. Uh, then, place camp campfire on the last cobblestone wall, and close it up on each side with spruce fan trapdoors. Now, I'm gonna just simply decorate this place, so just follow my steps. If you guys think we are done with interior, you are wrong. Look now what we're gonna do. We're gonna hide, we're gonna make a hidden room. So basically cut one, two, three, four, five blocks. Then go to the side here, to here, to here, and to here. Now we're gonna take oak planks and let, uh, just fill it up on the ceiling. That, fill it up on this side and simply place four ladders. After that, you want to take a sign carpet and at the middle place enchantment tape. Then you're gonna place a two barrels so you can hide your inventory here. And with a bookshelf, you're gonna replace the dirt. this place even more you just simply take a spruce trapdoor and close it up now this text the materials that I'm gonna use in this step I didn't put in a list because they're it up to you it's a simply decoration ideas that I use in this house so basically where we, we have a spigot I just simply make a small lake a small pond Then what we could do is take, I don't know if this is gonna work, I never tried, but yeah, you can make like this, so like it is floating every time. Now you're gonna take a grass pad and simply make a small pad to your house. Now you could take a spruce fence and with a couple stone slabs you're gonna place around your path. Now with the dark oak leaves you can also put around your path and around your pond. But most importantly place it around your house so it makes more interesting and it makes like there are vines around your house
After that, just simply decorate the place using the grass, using the flowers that you like. And at the very end, what you could do is take a hoe and basically place a few crops when you're around your pond. And there you go, guys. I show you how to create a really small and unique house that you could show your friends and be proud of. First of all, thank you guys for watching this video till end and if this tutorial was useful, please leave a like, comment down below what you think about this house and subscribe to my channel, it will mean a lot to me and let's see you next video, peace.